All right, everyone, back at it. The server shutdown happened, and I'm gonna try some PvP. Now, here's a disclaimer. The teams that I have are not designed to beat the Fiendish Imp, the um, stupid rabbit thing. Ooh, disgusting Imsling Elder Python. Okay, who's he gonna start first? I'm gonna start my Blighthawk first. Oh, nice. Wow, I forgot how slow that thing, that Anubis Hath Idol is. Oh, look at him getting lucky with a stun. Okay. Um, I'm just keep spamming on Ghostly Bite, or not Ghostly Bite, Infected Claw, until I go down. Um, that was really, really strange, but <laughs> I, I mean, I was going to kill his Anubis Sath Idol, but he had an Elder Python and a Disgusting Oozling, like it was anybody's game. He had a great advantage, a great matchup versus my Cottontail. Um, not sure why he bowed out there. I guess he probably saw the glint of determination in my rabbit's eyes and knew, just knew that he was going to lose oh that's kind of hilarious though seriously he even got lucky with a stun I think that rupture is only a 25% stun chance okay oh my gosh guys oh, I feel so freaking blessed right now it's my team it's the dark rat team Oh. Wow, this is like, I get a little choked up here where I'm going against my own team. <laughs> oh man, okay. This is a really, really bad matchup. He's gonna do Nocturnal Strike. Um, we'll go for a dodge to see if he still goes for the Nocturnal Strike through my dodge. Was that Nocturnal Strike? Or no, was that, let me see. Pet Battle. Okay, he went Savage Talons. Okay. All right, Jade Oozling, take the hit. Ooh, nice hit, buddy. Boom, 600, nice. Okay. He's got one more. Hmm, nicely done. He fought it out like a man. Now, he should switch into his rat and kill me, because his rat is way faster. But, <laughs> I am faster. No, I'm not actually faster. Um, I should probably just stay in and die on this guy and get an organic squid switch into him. Okay. Well... Yep, and just run in, sneak attack. Oh my gosh, I'm so freaking happy that people are running my team. I mean, I can't say it's like my team, but, you know, my videos got... Oh, see, I was expecting the Call of Darkness there. Okay. Now I'm going to burrow. Yep. His sneak attack actually may be able to beat me because, yeah, it's going to be hitting hard. All right, let's go. Oh, oh, that was silly. Why was I, why would I do that? And he's going to be faster than me. And he's going to just crouch again. Oh, he's not going to crouch. He's going for the kill. He's going for kill shot here. Okay. Um, this does 650. He's going to go for the kill. So, I'm going to die. I'll use an ability. Yeah. Yeah. We, oh, oh, oh. Okay. I was too indecisive. 
As long as I hit it, I'll kill him. What? How come I didn't kill him? He wasn't even running crouch. I guess I should have gotten infected claw. Okay. If I can hit him. Let's see. One, two, three. Yes! Okay. Now, I don't really think there's a way that I'm going to be able to win this. Because I played it rather poorly. Ooh. I would have gone Bone Brows first. Oh. This guy's going a little bit too hamsies. He's going to have Bone Brows this turn. Oh. That dot's... Yeah, it's going to kill me next turn. No, it won't kill me next turn. And my dodge will be up. Oh. This is exciting. Look. It does 40 damage. And I dodge and I win. Oh my goodness, guys. You just saw it here. I beat the Dark Rat team. Oh yeah. I'm a champion. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Holy cow. That's awesome. That was so flattering. And the reason I kind of am tooting my own horn here is because that was a team that I championed. Well, he he definitely could have won that. Uh, played it better. Like, instead of going Bone Barrage, Nocturne, or Bone Barrage, Call Darkness, Bone Barrage, Nocturnal Strike, Bone Barrage, he went Nocturnal Strike, or no, Call Darkness, Nocturnal Strike, Bone Barrage, and had nothing. So... Anyway, you don't want to play your Bone Serpent that way. Oh gosh. My heart is swelling with pride. Okay. Ooh. You know, he's probably going to go... Most people usually run the Iron Starlet first. Um, it really depends on if he's throwing this guy out. Or if he's going to go for like... Uh, Surge of power. Wow, he's going just like really big heavy hits. Um, we'll just throw out Thumper first. Okay. I really doubt that he's going to go anything. So I'll just start off with a flurry. He's probably going to go Arcane Storm. Yeah. Oh, hey, you know what Arcane Storm means? Check this out. Boom. Not stunned. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll just do Infected Claw until he dies. Oh, his Dragon Racial's up. Hit on the high end. Yes! Arcane Storm is great for my... Uh... Ooh. Okay. Okay. Dang it. I always hope they run Toxic Smoke, but Power Ball is definitely the better of the two options. Okay. Well, I'm going to do an Infected Claw and then a Ghostly Bite. And then I'm going to go into my Jade Oozling because... Um, okay, that's really weird. Why would he go supercharge? Okay. 227, yeah. I... I have no idea why he went supercharge there. I mean, yeah, that hurt a lot. Wait, he did more than... Okay, he has 280 health, so I'm gonna have to do expunge. How come he was allowed to hit that hard? Like, he did 518 damage, which is more than 33% of my health, whatever. So, we're gonna go creepy news. Oh. I love that he's using these big moves on my oozling here. Because my magic racial is being real nice. Okay. 
Dude, he just used two of his giant moves. Alright. Well. Yeah. What the? Look at this guy critting left and right. Holy strike hit me for... F How did that do that? That's unfair. Okay. And then he's probably going to charge this round. Or he's just going to hit me with that. Yeah. Okay. And... One more of these bad boys. And... This is 81, so all I need to do is hit twice. Sweet. Wow, this team is surprisingly good. Uh, <laughs> you know, I, I built it with... Not, like, actual PvP P in mind. It was specifically for the brawl. But, wow. It is not letting me down. <clears throat> okay. Hmm. Interesting setup. Yeah, I'm weak versus elementals. I need to start building teams that are strong versus elementals. And I need to just build elemental teams because they're just stupid good. Okay. <laughs> I've got a decoy breaker. I don't imagine him starting the zap I mean he okay yeah he may so here's what we're gonna do we'll start a flurry we're gonna do a second flurry I think I can dodge the bomb yeah that hits hard um we'll do burrow Oh no, that was silly. Because now I'm going to get hit by him and the bomb. Alright guys, this is a lesson on how not to use your... Uh, your rabbit. Yeah, I should have just used... Dodge and then Flurry. Really? He survives with 5 health. Okay. Come on, give me a triple hit here. No, a triple hit won't even be enough to kill him. Yeah, because he comes back with 309. It's okay. You're 273, you're 273. Okay. This is my only hope of killing him without taking damage. Sweet. Okay. And we're just gonna go. He's 289, so he's faster than me. He may switch me out. Uh, we'll go for a lift off. Okay. Why would he use Life Leech when he knew I was in the air? That didn't make sense. Yeah. Okay. This can theoretically kill him. No, it can't kill him because he's going to heal, yeah. Okay. So I kill him this round. But I can't switch out. Which is good for him. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. He's gonna life leech me, which is. Unless he does the bite. Oh, that's great. That's perfect. Yeah, he should have gotten the bite there. He would have killed me. Now time to throw out a ghostly bite, get a big chunk of damage here. Oh man, this guy is playing poorly. That would have done a ton of damage to my Jade Uzzling. Okay. And we are both slow. Okay, but I get to kill you with the expunge. Man, look at this team go. Alright, I'm going to change it up just because I was not expecting that to do so well. Um, 
there's not really synergy here and I don't really like the gold beetle so let me look really quickly get another Eastern Kingdom pet oh I like this spider okay so we will go molten hatchling we'll switch it in for this and Psychic Blast. Hey, I don't have an Arcane Winds. I don't think there's anybody on the Eastern Kingdoms who can generate Arcane Winds. Um, let's get a strong flying type. Do I have any? <clears throat> oh, the Molten Spider? Are you? No, yeah. You're a beast. Okay. I want to use a Elemental. I can either use Citizen Snips or... Let's see, I know there's one around here, the Hinter, no, not the Hinter, I just clicked on that. Where's Hillsbred Foothills? Yeah, not the Foothills, Arafi Highlands. Okay, they are the Tiny Twisters. Let's try the Tiny Twister. Tiny Bog Beast, you're kind of cool. Go Leap. It's bummer that those are a different cooldowns. And rampage. Yeah. I'll go leap, stun, and rampage. He'll be kind of a use his kit and then switch out. That is a lot of beast damage. Okay. We'll we'll, we'll see how it plays out. We'll save this team. Nope. We'll save it as. Okay, Ellie. Ooh, okay. Interesting, interesting. Yeah, he's probably running the water waverly. That's awesome. Okay. Um I kinda wanna play my molten hatchling against him. Start off with brittle webbing. Okay, so he's running frost nova. That's fine. Let's heal up the damage he did. We'll just re throw out brittle webbing. We'll do leech life again. And then when he hits me with geyser, that's when I'm gonna heal. Boom, big geyser hit. Oh, but it stuns you. Oh, I forgot about that. And I can't switch out. Good job, man. I played that like an idiot. Okay, I can rampage him. 350, I mean it's overkill. 210, it won't kill him. Okay, nice, got lucky. Let's do leap. I can do leap twice. Oh, okay. I'll just do this guy. He's probably gonna do a burn and then a flamethrower conflagrate. Conflagrate. Yeah. That is probably most definitely what he's going to be doing. Oh. Yeah. He's got his dragon racial up. Ooh, okay. Well, that's not too bad. We'll do leap. Ooh, if he even goes into... Oh, look. Well... <sighs> Should I stun him? Yeah, I'm gonna stun him and then leap twice. <sighs> this is weak versus flying. Okay. I'm faster than him. Um, he's probably gonna run lift off. Good, good game, man. <sighs> All right. 
that does weak, weak damage. Um, this takes three moves to do. That's 325. We will do a roar and then smash. And he is faster than me there. He got me below my racial. He's 260, I'm 260. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, he's faster. He can't kill me in one hit. I can't. Let's eat. Even if this hits on the lowest of low ends, I win. Holy cow. Nice one, Harambe. They can't keep you down, bro. Can't keep him down. All right, let's find battle. You know that tiny bog beast didn't do terribly. Neither did the molten hatchling, except I just forgot. Man, that's a great combo. That little water waverlin. Where is he? Yeah, right there. Yeah, running frost nova geyser. Make it so they can't switch out. It's not bad. Okay. Oh, same dude. Okay. Um. Pew, 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 pew. What should we do? Um. We will go Harambe first. And we're going to go for the one-shot barrel toss. Okay. This is going to hurt bad, this conflagrate. Oh, it crit. Oh, he could kill me this round. With me not having done any damage to him. Okay, he doesn't. That's well, a trade for a trade. And I'd rather... Uh, we'll go Tiny Bog Beast. Okay, he's gonna do Lift Off. So... I don't want to go faster than him, so I'm just gonna pass. And then this round... I'm gonna do... Yeah, there we go. And then we will do... We'll stun him. Okay. Yeah. Boom. Wow, that's so weak damage. Mm. Oh, I'm faster now. We'll go you, and we'll do Cauterize. Oof. Yeah, this should heal me to full. Yep. Okay. Brittle webbing, life leech. Okay. Ooh, ouch. And then this will kill him. The problem with this Water Waverling here is that he's just really fantastic 1v1. Okay. Yeah. We're going to go for a Cauterize, get my health back up, a Life Leech, and then we're going to switch into our Bog Beast. Should I? Should I switch here? Hmm. Bog beast. Yeah, we're gonna switch to the bog beast. Oh, he's gonna smash me super hard here. Oh. Okay. If I can go first. If I can go first. Dang it. Okay. Oh, hey. Hey, I totally missed it. Awesome. Okay, we're gonna go cauterize. 
fully hell healed. Okay. Yeah, I've, he ate the, I ate the stupid thing. The geyser. Okay. Healing up again. You know, this guy's doing really well for a new player. And the reason I say he's a new player is because he's got a green balance balance. Okay. Yeah. We're just going to have to try to kill him as soon as we can. Yep. And this round I kill. Oh. Okay, I can kill him with that. Man, it is so nice not to play against the uh, Tarot Claw Hatchling for a little while. And <laughs> this is not a tier one team by any means, but it's just nice for a change. I don't know if he lagged out or he just knew his demise was inevitable. And if that crit, that would have been a draw. Ah, that was great. Okay. Um, tiny bog beast. I think I'm gonna have to. Let's go. Uh, wind. Yeah, let's go elemental, type elemental. Where is it? There's our tiny bog beast. Winter. Lumpy. Sproutling. Yeah, we'll go this guy. Now, this is a super double edged sword. Okay, that's a terrible move. Yeah. Bash. Yeah, this is what we'll try on him. Okay, so the reason this is a very much a double-edged sword is because he is an elemental type that has a bunch of flying type moves, which means he'd be strong versus aquatics, but aquatics just absolutely shrek elementals. So, yeah, a little dangerous. Hey, you know, Harambe worked out pretty well. Do you see that? See him one shot that dude, 1100 damage with that barrel toss, not even a crit. But he had his beast racial active and he had roar damage, so that was like an extra 50% damage from that. Because I think the racial for beast type bats, yeah, is 25% extra damage, and then roar, yeah, 25, yes, yeah, so that's an extra 50% damage, yeah, that's a lot of extra damage. You know, I should try my Blizzard Bear in some things. He's from the fourth anniversary event. Um, I started playing World of Warcraft just before Wrath of the Lich King launched. And, uh, yeah, so that was probably my first anniversary event. <coughs> Excuse me. You know, I should try the Dark Short Cub in, like, a bleed team. Just because he's a power, power breed. He's, you know, there's actually not a ton of pure breeds out in the wild. There's like a fair amount of SS breeds and HH breeds, but not a lot of power, power breeds. And I love power, power breeds. It just hits so stupid hard. Like Maul with a bleed hits for 800 and what is that? 62 damage, 862 damage. Yeah, that's like 50% of anybody's health. So, that's pretty impressive. I haven't used this guy at all. You know, I need to start running that Wailing Caverns for the pets. There's so many pets that I need to just start working for. Poli. I bet you the code to get Poli is probably ridiculous. Oh, oh there we go, there we go. Okay. I'm excited to try that tiny twister. I've actually never used him in PvP before. Or in PvE. Because the only time that I would use him... Ooh. So, we have a hair. An SS hair. We have the Anixia. Drake. Hmm... I wonder who's going to go first. We'll go our Molten Hatchling first. P 
Power balance. Interesting choice. Oh, sorry, Hannah. That's for you. Um, we will just pass. Then we're going to do a cauterize. Hey, look. We've done no damage to each other. Okay, let's leech life. Yeah, dragons do so much damage. Holy smokes. And this guy also, he's just so stupidly, uh... What's the word? A weak? Yeah, that's, that's the word. Oh, we know he's running heal, so he can't change the leather on us. So let's do this. He's probably going to lift off. Yeah. Um... Does this hit through liftoff? Nope. Now he's gonna heal himself up for a ton. If he's smart, he'll take care of his... Yeah. <laughs> take advantage of his dragon racial, which he didn't. Okay. And we're gonna just do a flyby. I know it's weak. Ooh, nicely done, sir. Okay. And he's gonna kill me here. And then I can kill him on you. Uh, this is enough to kill. No, it's not enough to kill him. Dang it, I should have gone Harambe. Oh. Let's do a cauterize, get our health back up. Ooh. Shard of Kursk. I don't know if I've ever even used that guy. Okay. Oh, nerfing the healing. Wise choice. Uh, we'll try Harambe. You're faster. Okay, we'll just do a smash. Wow. Does 50% of his health before switching in. He's gonna dodge. I think. Oh. Okay. And we'll just do a smash when he comes out. It's gonna hurt. Okay. And he's probably gonna dodge. Yeah. And then he's gonna kill me this round. And this is exclusive to Harambe because it's under his photo. Okay. Oh, I should have gone cauterize. Why didn't I go cauterize? If I had gone cauterize, I would have had a chance. Oh, blast. Wasn't thinking. Really should have gone cauterize there. Good game. Good game. Okay, actually, this guy's kind of terrible. Um, Fjord pup, not anything. Let's see, beast types. Cheetah cub. Cornelius. You know, I want to do a bleed team. Bleed. Nuts has a bleed. Curious Wolvar. Okay. Dark Swarf. Yeah, I want you in it. And I want you running Maul. Um, yeah, you can run Hibernate, I guess. Yeah, sure. Um, man, if we get it like a Roar Maul with a bleed, how long does that bleed last? It lasts five rounds. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. Ooh, let's actually go for one of the... Uh, let's go Aquatics. One of the ones from Fishing Quest. Power speed, health power. Yep. That's what we'll do. We'll do this guy here. And... Then in our last slot, we need a dodge. You want to throw Bonkers in there? <laughs> bonkers is good. 
let's see. Who else has a dodge? Okay, so bonkers. Clock them. You have a dodge? Why would I use dodge on you? You have 211 speed. You know, I've never used a dust bunny before. So it's a five round cooldown, four round cooldown. We'll go five round cooldown. Okay. Alrighty, Roo, here it goes. Okay, this will probably be my last one for the night. And I'll probably start off with Snarly and go like a rip blood in the water unless he's running a flying type. Hannah, if you can notice my camera orientation, hopefully it's correct. You know, today I went to try to finish up this, uh, this guy here and I only need a few more parts. Okay. Yeah. Oh, Rendezvous. Oh, he's got a cheetah cup. Okay. I wonder if he's running deflection. Nope, he's not. Ooh, nice crit. Okay. That's gonna kill him. Yeah. Go into your cheetah cub, sir. Does this transfer? No, it doesn't. Yeah, okay. Now we're just gonna hibernate because he's not gonna be able to do very much damage to my Dark Shore Cub. And I should be able to heal up enough to switch back into Snarly. It's not terrible. Um, back into Snarly. Okay. Rip blood in the water. Reduces your next attack by what percentile? I don't know. Okay. Wow, that guy is so fast. Yeah, I'll just let him kill me. I know it gets rid of my mall capabilities. Uh, let's see. We will do 170 minus. Yeah, we'll still kill him. You know, I'm impressed at the work that Cheetah put out. Okay. And we're gonna go for a mall, get as much damage on this guy. Holy cow! Now I know he's just gonna go for a surge of power that is gonna just smack me and destroy him, which is fine. And now we're gonna go Dust Bunny, dodge, triple hit. Boom. Man, that Cheetah Cub. Props to you, bro. Nicely done. Well, guys, I think I'll finish this video up right now and uh, call it good for this. But these were almost all exclusively wild-caught pets except Snarly. He's the only guy who I played tonight who was not wild-caught. And the reason I played him over a crab was just because he has a basic attack here. And uh, I didn't get to use it, but still, that was the reason why. Anyway, hope you have a good night. Talk to you soon.